Using a stud sensor with an electrical wire sensor, mark all stud positions. You must have at least 14 inches between each stud. Draw vertical lines using a long level that will locate each edge of the stud. Determine the height of the bottom of the window and draw a horizontal level line. Remove the template marked on the box and align the template between the stud lines and transfer the outline to wall. Using a manual drywall saw, follow the template outline marked on wall to cut out and remove the wallboard. Use caution as there may be unseen obstacles. Cut away the insulation between the interior and exterior wallboard and remove. To transfer the window location to the outside wall, drill a hole in each of the bottom corners of the cutout. Be sure to keep the drill bit level and drill through both the outside wallboard and the exterior siding. You must now proceed to the exterior side of the wall. Using a level, draw a horizontal line at the bottom edges of the holes you just drilled. Align the bottom edge of the template with the horizontal line and the drilled holes and transfer the template outline to the siding. Using a reciprocating saw, cut along the template outline to remove the siding and exterior wallboard. Remove all the siding around the window openings at least six inches from the opening. A siding removal tool makes quick work of this step. Apply a one quarter inch bead of caulking around the top edge of the window opening. Place the mid-frame assembly into the opening, making sure it is level and in the center of the opening. This is critical when installing multiple windows. Secure to the wall using the supplied stainless steel fasteners. Starting at bottom, place and secure flashing tape over mounting flange, working vertically, making sure all flanges are covered with tape. Replace the siding that was removed earlier. It should fit close to the protruding wall of the window frame and over the mounting flange surrounding the mid frames. Remove temporary transporting clips and place the exterior trim onto the mid frame. The mid frame will cover the siding and serves as a 3 quarter inch siding return. Fasten with the 3 quarter inch stainless screws that were removed when unpacking the window. Push the decorative white screw covers into each screw hole and you are finished with installation on the exterior wall. Proceed back to the interior wall. Using a portion of the insulation that was removed earlier, fill all voids between the mid-frame jam extension and the studs. Insulation should be lightly packed for best performance. Place interior trim over mid-frame jam extension and secure using the supplied finish nails. Congratulations, you have just installed a beautiful Geometrics window. You may wish to paint the window to match the rest of the windows in your home. Go right ahead. The polymers used to manufacture Geometrics windows are paintable. Visit geometricswindows.com for more details.